Introducing the most simplified trading platform. What we're going to do now is show you how easy it is to make your first trade on the platform. What we want to do first of all is start in the trading section of the platform, here at the top. We can see that we have a number of markets to choose from, from currencies to stocks, commodities and indices. Alternatively, if we want to trade the options featured right now by the analysts, we can click on Top Picks. Or if we want to trade our favorite assets for easy reference, we can click here. All right, let's say you want to make a trade on the Euro-USD pair. We can see that the payout offers us 85% for the next expiry time on our platform. We can trade 60 second expiries. Or if we want, we can select an alternative expiry time, available in 15 minute intervals through the hour. What we'll want to do is look at the chart and ask the basic question. Will the Euro-USD pair close above or below the current market price? Now, if we believe that the price will be higher than the current price at the end of the expiry time we selected, we'll be clicking here to buy a call option. If we believe that the price will be lower than the current price at the end of the expiry time we selected, then we'll be clicking here to buy a put option. Now, if we want, before we make a determination on the market price, we can use a few trading tools by clicking on the dashboard here. The first to note is our trader sentiment, which allows us to better gauge the direction traders are speculating on for this asset. Another tool to note is our riskometer. Now, what this does is allow us to adjust the payout level prior to making a trade. A great opportunity to increase my payout if I'm really confident or increase the rebate level if I'm less confident. Notice there's an inverse relationship here. So the higher payout, the lower the rebate. So let's say I'm quite confident here and I want to select an 85% payout on the Euro USD option. Another key instrument is what we call our social trading. This allows us to view other traders' positions on the chart their investment decisions and learn from the collective wisdom of other traders. I can close my dashboard here and once again look at the chart to make a determination. Let's say I believe the price is going to trend downward. I'll click here to buy a put option. The next step is to enter the investment amount. All right, let's say on this trade, I want to choose an investment amount of $250. So. I'll click here to open up a put option on the Euro USD for $250 to fall below the current price with the return we've spoken of. We'll review the trade details and then click here to confirm the trade. Okay, fantastic, the trade was accepted. In my positions, we can now see a summary of our open positions, including the instrument, the direction, and strike price, or the current price at which we've opened the trade, the expiry time and current profit level. As you can see, some of the assets have a sellback indicator under the payout. This indicates the option to close your trade during the open trade time prior to the expiry time you have chosen. You will be shown your return by clicking on the sellback buttons and will have three seconds to confirm the sellback. Okay, let's fast forward and see how we did. Let's take a look at our put option on the Euro USD. I see that it closed in the money with an expiry price below my option price. So the return there is $462.50 back to my account. We then opened up a put option on crude oil features and I can see that it closed out of the money with an expiry price above my strike price. So the return there is $22.50 back into my account. And the third option we opened was a call option on the GBP USD. And that closed in the money with an expiry price above my option price. So the payout there is $342. Open an account now. Start trading today.